Very quiet, boss. Very quiet, boss. No, I'm good. It's just about the dry dust and that wet land. Yeah, I'll have to send it off a piece of paper. There are watches on the hill where the wind was blowing chill, and the hare was being hunted down below. There were watches on the hill standing silently and still. When the holler came and horn began to blow, they drew across the field to the hounds a scent revealed. In excitement they moved quickly on the line, as they drew across the field, over eager voices pealed, with a music that brought tingles to the spine. But the hounds had overrun and the first trick had been won. By the crouching hare, in haste they passed her by. But the crow hounds had overrun, and the first move had begun in the game in which a hare would live or die. The holler checked their haste, so quickly they retraced to the warm, fresh scent of game upon the green. The holler checked their haste, and that rising scent did taste. As they wheeled upon the spot where they she'd been seen. In full cry they made a way where the fresh warm scent still lay, with the huntsman blowing hard upon his horn. In full cry they made a way, for they had no time to stay, as they sped along the track the sheep had worn. They climbed the heather hill with their music ringing still. As it echoed round the valley far below, they climbed the heather hill, where the wind was blowing chill, and full speed across its dark rough plain did go. They flew in circle wide, giving push no push no time to hide, as they pushed around the wall and head of the land. They flew in circle wide, then down that steep hillside, to the green fields where it started they came back. But a puzzled puss had laid, as her instinct she obeyed, when she doubled back across some marshy ground. But the puzzle puss had laid, yet the hounds not long delayed, ere the second course they quickly started round. Their joyful voices rung, while with heart and soul they flung all their energy into that glorious chase. Their joyful voices rung, and the wiry heather star, as across the moor they went at furious pace. They drove into the rain, but the hair they could not gain, as she went into the valley far below. They drove into the rain, stretched athletic muscle frame, for they knew her pace had now begun to slow. As they reached the valley floor, their success they felt was sure, yet the scent had now begun to quickly fade. As they reached the valley floor, a tired hare the watchers saw, spirit broken, by a dry stone wall she stayed. <laughs> now the hounds with innate skill, with persistence pursued still, and the leading hound, the broken athlete's leading hare, sorry, and the leading hound, the broken athlete spied. Now the hounds with innate skill, fell upon her for the kill, and the huntsman's trembling horn told she had died. That's it.